Google Earth is one of the best tools for checking up on places around the world. With a few simple clicks, you can move from your living room to the other side of the world and get an idea of what it's like to live there. But as we know it, the Earth holds many secrets and out-of-bounds buildings where the public isn't welcome, even if from the satellite perspective. Join us as we explore some of the most censored places on Google Earth. Tontauco Park in Chile Now, it's a very odd thing that Google Earth isn't allowing you to zoom in on what seems like a simple park space in Chile, right? Well, as it turns out, this park is privately owned and holds some of the most endangered species that we have ever seen. Although we're sure this only brings up more questions, considering it is a popular tourist site, what exactly is it that it may be hiding? The Anthrax Island in Scotland Now here's what you should know about Anthrax Island. It got its name after British scientists tested out a series of anthrax bombs during the Second World War. The island is located in a bay in Scotland, but it's not accessible to the human population. And why would you even want to live on an anthrax-contaminated island in the first place? Anthrax chemical weapons were tested on 60 sheep, who died within a few days. And there's absolutely nothing on the island except for a one mile long and less than a mile wide piece of land. So there's nothing to see here. Just move along. Roswell, New Mexico now you've probably heard of Roswell before, and if not, here's a quick lowdown for you. It's one of the most well-known UFO sites in the entire planet, hence it can't be accessible through Google Earth. Which makes complete sense, right? Sightings of extraterrestrial activity in Roswell have been reported since more than 50 years ago, and are still going strong today. Of course, with such reports come many controversial statements, and things really hit the fan when people realized they can't see Roswell on Google Earth. Remember the 1970s news that an alien spacecraft had crashed in the Roswell, New Mexico area, and that the aliens were supposedly taken to a secret facility? It's definitely not the only Roswell alien sighting that we've heard of. So is there any truth to all of the rumors? And does that mean that extraterrestrial life can really be spotted on Earth? Or is it all just a much bigger mystery that we'll probably never have answered? The Nepal Snow Saddle Alright, now this isn't exactly a UFO sighting, and it doesn't even have any significance to the government. Or at least we think it doesn't. But the fact is, this 22,000 feet high part of Nepal is not allowed to be seen on Google Earth. And this brings a lot of questions. Many suggest that the Nepal Snow Saddle is just another secret entrance to a UFO base, and nobody's really sure what's going on in those mountains. But you want to hear something even more strange? The area was completely visible just a few years ago. So whoever made that area hold important government secrets has done so in just the past two years. So come on, Google Earth, why be so secretive? If any of you decide to take that 22,000 foot hike, be sure to let me know what's up there. Narsarsic, Arctic Circle in Greenland. Now sometimes Google Earth satellites don't have legitimate reasons to black out a few places on the planet, like the Arctic Circle. However, you'll notice that some parts of Greenland are blurred out on Google Earth. Now, there's no official explanation as to why, but the public does speculate that it's due to the 1968 Thule Air Base crash, which carried four hydrogen bombs when it came crashing down and left the area completely contaminated and abandoned. On the other hand, though, we doubt that there would be much to see in that area anyways. Although the entire site seems to be contaminated with plutonium, it's best just to stay away. The Atolls of French Polynesia, South Pacific Google Earth seems to have a thing for protecting all bomb explosion sites, and the same goes for the atolls in the French Polynesia. Located 620 miles away from Tahiti, they probably look like an interesting sight to see in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. But the truth is, almost 200 nuclear weapons were tested on the land and underground which is probably the reason why they're so far away from anyone whatsoever. 
The islands are heavily contaminated and known as one of the most deadly places on Earth. So, unless you really want to see what radiation looks like, you should probably just stay away. The Volkel Air Base in the Netherlands If you ever wondered how Volkel Air Base in the Netherlands looks, you might be in for a big disappointment. That's because you can't see it. The area is oddly pixelated on Google Earth, but the secrets behind it may be bigger than we think. According to reports made by WikiLeaks, the site also holds 22 tactical nuclear bombs, which are said to be owned by the United States. The area itself is most likely blocked to keep the curiosity away from some of the war machinery, like the Fighting Falcon Squadrons and the Trauma Helicopter. Google Earth might possibly keep this a secret to prevent enemies from discovering valuable information, and if so, they get a free pass. Girona, Spain Now, what could be hidden inside the Spanish city of Girona? No one's quite sure, but all you can see on Google Earth is a black block. No pixels, no blurs, just a blacked out block, which means there's even more secrets. The area is pretty much empty, but a Google search can reveal the place has a Restricted Access Military Zone sign. Looking from the aerial Google map perspective, you can only really see a few outlines of buildings, but the mystery remains. What exactly is happening there? And what happens if you cross over that Restricted Access? Junction Ranch, California the mysterious Junction Ranch in California's Mojave Desert isn't like any other sensory place that we've listed so far. Although you can clearly see that there is something there, only parts of the base are shown, and those parts are heavily edited, with intentionally scratched out buildings and probably edited out pathways. One can only wonder what on earth is going on there that's so important that it can't be revealed. This site is used for a radar cross-section RCS testing area, and it might be the reason why it requires a low distribution from any satellite, including Google Earth. 2207 Seymour Avenue in Cleveland, Ohio Now imagine having no idea that your next-door neighbor has been hiding three girls in captivity for over a decade. The house where Ariel Castro kept Amanda Berry, Gina De Jesus, and Michelle Knight was blurred out on Google until it was demolished. And the area where the house once stood is still blurred out. The part next to the house was transformed into a garden in August of 2013 in order to honor the three victims and their strength. Nordwijk on Zee in the Netherlands if you look up this small town in the Netherlands, you're going to notice that for some bizarre reason, a large chunk of the area is pixelated to the point where it doesn't even look like normal pixels. It just kind of looks like someone put a camouflaged circle on a very odd place within the Netherlands. And what's the significance of all this? Well, whether it holds important buildings you're not allowed to see, or comes with a royal value, the whole thing is just bizarre. That's because you're able to access it on Street View. The area was first reported as blurred out a few years ago, although Google Earth sometimes does lose data on a few of its satellite images. It seems very odd that even our next place has more coverage than a little town in Netherlands. Area 51 one of the biggest mysteries that's ever existed is without a doubt Area 51, and it definitely deserves an honorable mention on our list. Ever since its first report of a possible extraterrestrial life was noted on the site, there have been millions of attempts to get closer to this military base. Although parts of the base actually became visible on Google Earth over time, we believe that just like the Junction Ranch, they're heavily edited. And as you can see, many large areas are still whited out. Not only are parts of Area 51 censored on Google Earth, unless you have a government authorized plane, you'll not even be able to fly over the area. And if you do, you're probably gonna die. So what exactly is Area 51 hiding? Spaceships, buildings with aliens, underground tunnels, bombing sites, maybe large experimental facilities? Well, don't go getting sucked into the research, because you'll only become more and more frustrated. 
Area 51 has been debunked several times, but the outer space lovers are not giving up. UFO enthusiasts and those who want to believe are sure that the military base is holding secrets about extraterrestrial life and are looking into every single Google Earth detail. Ever since its introduction of Google Maps, the world has seen some truly bizarre censorship. Did you know that because Colonel Sanders was a real person, Google Maps had to censor out all KFC logos with his face? And much like the buildings belonging to the government, Google Maps is not allowed to show people's faces, heavy crimes, violence, or anything that's potentially dangerous to civilization. However, that doesn't stop people from asking questions. This has been a look at some of the most censored places on Google Earth, but what did I leave out? And have you ever been to any of these places? Tell me all about it in the comments below, and thanks for watching. Intentionally designed to look like a beautiful oak tree, Google Earth users found a shocking discovery when they realized what this Dixon-based church actually looks like from above. Have you figured it out yet?